Hey, what's up everybody? Thanks for clicking on the video. David Pendleton here covering hole number eight of the fall major tournament and I'm going to suggest a bag change here as I'm going to play with the Grizzly Club. It's a club that I very rarely play with but we are getting in Grizzly range so let's go ahead and give it a shot. 0% at max on the drive so extra mile in Grizzly is what we need. Six top, no side spin. We're going to play right here in between the brown tree and the green tree. Ball guideline, uh, moving my target up until you see that I hit the rough and then I roll out onto the top part of the fairway that we're aiming at. 0% at max on the pool. No overpower, okay? Again, this is the rough bump rollout. You don't wanna overpower and then end up hitting that rough by the bushes that we're aiming over. That could happen. Now my shot here is played 15% at max. We're gonna go with one bar of side spin to the left. And you can see here we're gonna go with a couple bars of back spin. I'm gonna put the ball guideline to the hole, just like this. 15% at max is my pool, so four miles an hour was like 5.2 rings. Uh, I'm barely gonna miss this one to the right hand side. So we either need to add a little bit more side spin or I would change the elevation. I'd probably bump the elevation up maybe another 5%. But here's the bad part with the Grizzly, and it's why I hardly ever play with it, is because as you start to move the elevation, um, your rings, they they go up by quite a bit, right? To whereas if you're playing with um, a Goliath or, you know, a Backbone, your ring pool is a little bit different. Now, I know the ring sizes are different, but it just gives you a little bit more room for error. So it's probably more beneficial to tweak the side spin than change the elevation with the Grizzly. But those are my thoughts for hole number eight. It is a tougher albatross, but I mean, it's definitely there. So I hope you're able to pick it up. That would be super sweet. Please subscribe. Please hit the thumbs up. I'll see you soon to wrap up the front nine. Thanks, everybody.